The first major tech showcase of the year is underway at the Consumer Electronics Show in Las Vegas, where major tech firms are putting artificial intelligence at the forefront of their new product announcements. 4,500 exhibitors, including 1,400 startups and giants like Samsung and Meta, are attending this event. Kate Fisher is covering this story for CNA. The future of tech is bright, beautiful and artificially intelligent, according to the exhibitors lining the conference halls of the Las Vegas Strip this week. We will embed AI across every category and every product and every service to deliver one seamless, unified AI experience. From vacuums to washing machines, tech companies are embedding artificial intelligence in nearly everything as they develop products they believe have real-world benefits that consumers will want to buy. Samsung even staged this special exhibition to showcase how their products can be AI companions for everyday life. One of the themes of this year's show is that AI is everywhere and this proves that it's even in your fridge. Open left fridge door. Physical AI, that is robotics, is a major theme this year as inventors push boundaries and sometimes fall short. But so much of this innovation relies on hardware that is in short supply. Right now, the biggest issue is with the memory chips, because all of these devices, whether it's a PC, a smartphone, a robot, they all need memory to run. And the challenge we're seeing right now is the cost for memory has gone up dramatically. And that's unfortunate because a lot of these devices need more memory to run these newer models than the old devices did. So the challenge we're seeing really right now is more on sort of supply and demand of other components. How semiconductors are made, the issues with Taiwan, geopolitical issues, of course, that's still all there, hanging over uh, everyone. Chip makers are center stage at CES. The CEO of NVIDIA, the world's most valuable publicly traded company, giving a nearly two-hour keynote speech. We can now know that AI is going to proliferate everywhere. CES has become a kind of battleground for chip makers, with NVIDIA's industry rivals AMD, Intel and Qualcomm also delivering keynote speeches as they try to reassure investors that the AI boom is durable. For CNA, I'm Kate Fisher in Las Vegas. And after putting artificial intelligence firmly in the spotlight at the CES, NVIDIA is now laying out what comes next. Chipmaker CEO says its next generation of AI chips is already in full production, promising a major leap in computing power. Comes as NVIDIA faces intensifying competition, both from industry rivals and its own customers. NVIDIA's flagship Vera Rubin platform, set to launch later this year, brings multiple chips together in a single system. All these systems can be linked up, allowing thousands of chips to operate as one. The AI chip leader says the performance gains come from proprietary data formats, which NVIDIA hopes will become industry standard. This is completely revolutionary. This is how we were able to deliver such a gigantic step up in performance, even though we only have 1.6 times the number of transistors. NVIDIA also unveiled new features aimed at helping AI chatbots manage complex conversations on a very large scale and introduced a new self-driving car software called Elpa Mail, which the company plans to open source. Well, these announcements coming as rivals step up their challenge. Advanced Micro Devices CEO also taking the stage at CES, unveiling the company's latest AI chips, part of its bid to narrow the gap in the race for AI dominance. They include the new MI455 AI processors, chips designed for data center servers, already being sold to customers like ChatGPT, maker OpenAI. MI-455 is the most advanced chip we've ever built. It's pretty darn big. 
It has 320 billion transistors, 70% more than MI355. It includes 12 2 nanometer and 3 nanometer compute and I.O. chiplets and 432 gigabytes of ultra fast HBM4, all connected with our next gen 3D chip stacking technology. The CEO also unveiling the MI440X. That's an enterprise chip designed to run AI inside existing corporate systems. She then looked further ahead, previewing the MI500 AI chips, all that are said to offer a major leap in performance when they launch next year. AMD remains one of NVIDIA's strongest challenges, but it is still playing catch-up. A deal signed with OpenAI in October boosting confidence in AMD's chips and software. Still, analysts say it's unlikely to shake NVIDIA's dominance, with demand for its AI chips far outstripping supply.